Hey there, how are you all doing? Welcome to Motocar, important video family, canonical review of the Shoei Neotech 3, the best-selling motorcycle helmet from the Japanese brand, gets a makeover with this third generation that you all were asking for, with lots of new features to keep it as one of the best modular motorcycle helmets you can buy. That's for sure. What are the features of Shoei Neotech 3? Hey, how is this amazing Shoei Neotech 3 helmet? We'll tell you about it in this video. Well, finally, what I was saying has arrived. Many of you were asking, when will this ultimate modular Shoei Neotech 3 helmet arrive? Well, we already have it on the table. Obviously, this update corresponds to the fact that this new model has the 2206 certification, the most demanding to date. Although I must mention that, in my opinion, the Shoei Neotech 2, well, probably would have passed it too. But simply, yes, this new model does meet this new certification since Shoei safety standards are very high and they prioritize meeting the latest industry requirements. That being said, in case you didn't know, just so you know, we have a video where we explain in more detail how this new homologation is, which basically has more impact points in the tests, an important rotational test, and above all, in modular helmets, more demanding requirements in the chin strap closure system, which by the way, we will see in more detail soon. And obviously all of this is fulfilled by this Shoei Neotech 3. By the way, it's also a modular helmet with the PJ certification that allows you to ride with the chin guard open, just so you know. Additional things, hello, the closure, as you mentioned it, it has undergone a renovation and now it is a revitalized closure. It's one of the main novelties. This new generation has a locking system, in this case renewed, called pivot locking system, which is made of stainless steel and basically what it's about is that the closure pivots are wrapped in a material for better insulation. However, when it comes to the side covers of the chin guard, it is crucial to understand that they play a significant role in reducing the noises caused by the wind inside the helmet. This feature is highly appreciated by riders, as modular motorcycle helmets typically offer less insulation compared to full-face motorcycle helmets. Without a doubt, like I said, the closure has been revamped and improved compared to the previous generation. There you have the first thumbs up for the Shoei people. More things, what hasn't changed is the chosen material for this helmet. There are no surprises in this section, since like all Moto Shoei helmets, the Neotech 3 is made of a set of fibers called AIM, resistant to impacts and abrasion, and also allows to lighten the whole thing, which, hey, being a modular motorcycle helmet, they usually tend to be slightly heavier helmets, and this is appreciated. No surprises here, as I mentioned, a showy helmet, crafted with premium materials, absolutely worth it. With regards to the design, well, it is also highly consistent, as there do not seem to be any significant changes when compared to the previous generation, this is also something that needs to be acknowledged. In terms of the screen, there are news to share with you, dear family. It has been completely renewed compared to the previous generation. Firstly, we have a renewed central locking system, which used to be located on the side. Secondly, the screen itself is now much wider, allowing you to install an anti-glare film that comes included in the box, as usual. And finally, the screen border has been enhanced with a new rubber material, improving the insulation system. These are the exciting updates we have for you regarding the screen of our latest generation product. Stay tuned for more. On the other hand, the sun visor has also undergone a major overhaul as it is 5 millimeters taller than the previous generation to prevent any light from entering, reflecting from the bottom part. It still continues to be a very well-made viewer that this time has even more adjustments, more ergonomics, and you can easily activate the S key like the previous generation from the left exterior side, just like before. Well, in a top-of-the-line modular motorcycle helmet, family comfort is a fundamental aspect. Here as well, well, puff out your chest. These helmets are designed to handle long distances on the bike, a modular helmet designed for touring use. And in fact, traditionally, as I mentioned, Shoei is well known for producing helmets that provide an outstanding fit and comfort. And this Shoei Neotech 3, obviously, as I mentioned, takes great pride in that. The padding inside, FYI, is 3D designed using different fabrics based on head contact areas. And most importantly, they're fully washable and detachable. Keep it in mind. On the other hand, also, you should know that they have been manufactured to minimize the noise inside the helmet. Remember that we are talking about a modular motorcycle helmet that, as we say, does not usually isolate as much as a full face helmet. And in this case, we find a side padding with noise reducer and another one in the ears. This way we minimize, as I say, any discomfort. Anyway, remember that just so you know, Shoei has the personal fitting system to customize the interiors to your specifications and ensure a perfect fit, you know? Well, regarding the soundproofing, 
You should know that the base of the side paddings has also been designed for an excellent fit and soundproofing. Additionally, the position of the sun visor has been changed inside to move it away from the ear area, and the mechanism cables have been covered to prevent noise from appearing. Well, small details that you cannot see, hey, but Shoei has incorporated them into this helmet design. To conclude the interior section, we must also remind you that this helmet fits prescription glasses like a modular helmet for your information. So in short, the interior has been improved to have better soundproofing and on the other hand, also better fit. On the other hand, folks, we can't forget about the ventilation section either. You should know that we have two lower air intakes and one upper intake, all right? And the interesting thing is that the chin vent has a removable grid that, you know, keeps out mosquitoes and insects. So yeah, you can take that into account. Likewise, just so you know, the position of the rear spoiler has also been repositioned compared to the previous generation. Well, a few more aspects to take into account. There are certain characteristics that I believe we cannot overlook, for instance, and they hold equal significance as mentioned, this Shoei Neotech 3 possesses numerous accessories like the intercom system. Shoei Lin, with a much more compact integration than the previous generation, keep that in mind, it's perfect, very discreet, very accurate. Here Shoei, the Shoei people and Senna make a perfect match and there are also several accessories in the box like the chin cover, the nose cover and as we said, the anti bopin lock film, also worth mentioning. Finally, a micrometric closure in this case made as a good showy in aluminum, a type of closure that also makes a lot of sense in a helmet like this. So let's do a little summary of everything I've explained to you in this video. The Shoei Neotech 3 motorcycle helmet has been upgraded to maintain its position as the leading choice in this helmet category due to its exceptional quality, materials, finishes, comfort and features. So when we think of a modular motorcycle helmet, a flip-up helmet, this Shoei comes to mind. It is a helmet, as I previously mentioned, a bestseller that will undoubtedly continue to be one of the most popular items in this new generation of products. As I mentioned, if you desire one of the finest modular motorcycle helmets, possibly the finest, then this is the helmet for you the Shoei Neotech 3. Well, tell us if you have the previous generation, if not, if you've ever had a Shoei motorcycle helmet. You can inform us anything you want in the comments below. I also remind you that we provided a link in the first comment with the updated price and availability at the time of this interesting helmet, in case you want to check it out. And if you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, it would be nice to give us a like, a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that the motocar community keeps growing every day because that's what it's all about. Until next time.